hello sunflowers it is so hot in here you do not understand like i am about to die right now but i am super excited for today's video i'm doing a thrift with me today i'm on the search for some new outfits i'm traveling to north carolina there'll be videos of that in the future but right now i'm looking for some outfits for it and i just thought bringing you guys along the thrift with me would be a good time so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna jam out i'm gonna have a good me day i just yeah let's let's go so i just took my glasses off really fast you know um character change our first stop is going to be avalon exchange it's 40 minutes away i've never been it's in a really cool part of st louis if you guys didn't know i live in like a very suburban suburb scene suburby area outside of stl i don't go into the city too much but today um we're kind of doing it it's not like the city city but i think it's gonna be a good time okay we're gonna put the ox uh, i got the ox don't worry friends all my friends in the car i i'm gonna control the music i got some really great music taste turn left onto nos road do it in the mirror moving like Turning right because I'm a okay. In a We're taking our own around. Also, I forgot to show you guys. <laughs> He's staring at me. I forgot to show you guys my outfit, so quick clip inserted here. All right, so this is my outfit today. I'm wearing this shirt from Wet Seal. Necklaces are Zaffle. Sorry, I'm getting out of focus. Um, this skirt is from Goodwill. We love, we love a thrifty girl in the thrifty video. <laughs> and then my shoes are just Target. They're like really beaten old, but yeah. Those, yeah. I feel like a Macron 12 year old boy right now. I feel like a hipster grunge girl in mom jeans going thrifting like I am. This song and pretty much everything by, um, let me make sure I'm right about this. I'm pretty sure it's the fray. Yeah, the fray makes me feel like I'm like my 12 year old self. A boy just snapshot me and told me he didn't like like me, and this is what I would listen to in my bunk bed. All right, guys. So I just looked for parking for probably like 30 minutes. Super stressful. I'm a really untalented parker driver. Um, you know how that is. Um, now I'm parked like back on like a side street neighborhood thing, like against the road. I don't know if I can park here. So I can't believe this is my first time being in this area. It's actually like so cute. I definitely should have. Check this area out before. I get to my car and I'm just walking around just checking out because everything's so cute right here we have this cute little Ben and Jerry's I've never seen like an actual store of it this area is so cool okay now I'm headed over to vintage vinyl and that's not a thrift store so this video is not exactly what it was like Titled, but I'm in the area. I just want to check it out before I head over to some more shops. So, yep. Guys, I am in celebration because there's no ticket. So apparently I was allowed to park here or I just wasn't caught. So 
Woohoo, on to my next store and I'll give you guys, oh, oh, look how tight this is. We are not okay. All right, so I have arrived at my next location, Savers. It's about 30 minutes away. I've never been to Savers. I don't even honestly know if it's actually like a thrift store or not. We're gonna go inside and check it out together. I'm in like a really like reminiscent, I'm forgetting, I'm like blanking on English area. Um, I'll show you guys after I leave, but I'm like right next to a hotel I lived in for a whole summer. Um, which sounds really weird, but yeah. So I'm gonna do my car haul of what I got. Let me make sure I'm in focus, okay. From Avalon, I got three things. I'm really excited. They aren't very summery, but I think I could make them work summery. So the first thing is summery. This is looks really random and maybe kind of grandma to you, but I just like loved the colors. I thought it was super duper cute. And what I plan on doing with it is like making it like, you know, like folding it up and then like tying it in my hair cute. You know, this is a size large. Um, it's by the brand Harlow. I don't know what that is, but I think if I get a clip of this on, I wasn't positive on this because I wish it was a little bit longer, but I figured I could just wear it with like short shorts that you still couldn't really see and then it would be really cute with some nice sandals. The collar, like it's really like, it looks really funky not on. The end of the sleeves are super cute. They like flare out. It has this like literally like the most like vintagey fun collar ever. Okay, I'm in focus still. Um, and it's just denim, it's huge. It might be a little hot, so I couldn't wear it like here. And I don't, this might sound stupid, but I don't know if North Carolina is like the same temperature as Missouri or like what, but maybe I can sport it there. If not, it'd be really cute for the fall. I paid $8 for this. So, I mean, that's super cheap. Like I think thrift stores should be like $3, but I, I understand this place is in a really expensive location. So I got this anyway, because I thought it was really cute. And then the last thing I'm so excited about, because I've wanted, something like this for like 12 years it's a denim jacket um i really don't know what brand it is i paid 24 dollars for this which is kind of a lot for a thrifty find but it fit me exactly how i wanted like a jean jacket too when i've been like on the market for one so it's like oversized it's the perfect denim color i was looking for i just i don't know i'm obsessed with it i've literally been looking for like a baggy perfect like oversized jean jacket that's affordable for so long so although this was kind of expensive for a thrift store find it's really really nice like it's super duper heavy even right now while i'm holding it so yeah and this is a cute bag i love my finds there and now we're gonna head into our next stop they have a lot of these Ralph Lauren polo shirts, which are really nice. They're a little expensive for a thrift store, $8. I'm not like willing to pay for a t-shirt, but they're really cute. And I like the color of this one. I find that I almost always find shoes I like at thrift stores, so that's what I'm checking out now. $8 is a bit pricey for these, but I really like like the plasticky like baby doll kind of look of these. Those are really cute. So I tried this one on because I thought it had the potential to be like a cute summery top. But I think this cut really keeps me from wanting to buy, purchase this or buy this. But it is a cute pattern. So I thought this one would be nice for the beach. It's like this sear sucker. It reminds me a lot of Lauren James. But the zipper is unfortunately broke, so this one's not gonna work either, but it was a good try on because this would have been a very like preppy North Carolina look, I feel. Okay, so I'm back. I did get that one thing that I thought I was gonna get. This Life is Good t-shirt. Super cute. I think it just looks like kind of beachy and just nice for the summer. I'm gonna show you guys the little area I'm in, just kind of reminisce for a second on the fact that I used to live in a hotel. So I'll show you guys that also it's so hot in here let's scoot forward back to my grandma position this is like honestly guys go out and thrift this is make it by yourself like it may sound like weird or uncomfortable shot by yourself but i'm in the best mood right now and i just feel so happy okay so a little tour time this place coming up on my left is where we used to do our laundry like i remember sitting in here that okay that golden corral right here so i know it's a quick transition it's on the other side of the road we used to walk here and eat dinner there like all the time and then this is the place that i stayed the hotel i stayed at for a whole summer while we waited for to find a house when we moved to st louis when i was in first grade so this used to be the home i remember there being a pool i wonder if it's like in the middle yep i see the pool i remember swimming in that like every day so yep that was kind of just for fun they're gonna be like so confused why i'm driving up here and filming so we're gonna go
I am so sweaty and like beat because it's like 3 30 and all I've eaten today is two donuts. But now I'm headed into the Salvation Army, which I've also never been to before. So, no experience. Okay, so, update, my mom is obviously now in the car and it's rolling. Why are you doing this right now, Shannon? parking. I have to drive. Um, we just got ice cream at McDonald's and then we're headed to another thrift store and um, Barnes and Noble, like I told you guys. Actually, I don't know if I told you guys. I'm going to get a devotion book to do with my morning books that I do every morning, which are in like every video, but I want to add a book to it. So, that's the update. Okay, so we are arrived at Goodwill. Pretty much honestly just here to get a thumbnail picture because I couldn't take one when I was by myself shopping. Uh, pretty much done shopping. Like, I need my expertise, yeah. my <laughs> camera skills. <laughs> now turning Shani into a thrifter. Always been, girl, always been. Mm -hmm. They have this really cute gingham PJ set, which I love. The bottoms are capris, good for the summer. The summer. Scared, you scared, you scared. <laughs> and get run over. Last stop of the day, going to get the devotion book I talked about, and then finally catch up. this vlog out. I just left Barnes and Noble. They didn't have my devotion book so I just ordered it off Amazon but I actually picked up this book to read for fun called Emergency Contact. I'll let you guys in the future know if I like it or not. It's just a fun one not like a inspirational book or anything like that. Just fun. So I'll see you some vlogs in my next video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Comment down below any video requests for this summer and be sure to check out my Instagram and my Twitter.